I'm going to demonstrate the two minute fishing pole. I got this idea from making a bamboo fishing pole. I wanted to make a bamboo pole for a summer reading project. I couldn't find any bamboo that was cheap so I walked through Home Depot and I found this 97 cent PVC pipe. Grab the gray stuff. The white stuff is going to be about three times as expensive. This is called electrical conduit. It's 97 cents. You will take uh, this piece and then you will cut about two feet off. Um, you can use a hacksaw to do this. I like this pipe cutter or whatever it's called. Cut off that last two feet. You can get rid of this, but don't throw it away because you can use it for another project. So I'll show on a little post. So now we have about eight foot right here um, with our PVC. Another supply that you'll need is this insulation, this foam insulation for pipes. Uh, you can buy one 10 foot piece for about 97 cents. You can get five different like grips for your fishing pole out of this. I've already cut them down to this size right here. I'm gonna go ahead and put them on. Put the small piece on the front so that it can be gripped by the front hand. Just twist it on. Put the back one on a little bit further back. Now you have a nice little holder for your fishing pole. A couple other things we use, these little coat hook type things. You're going to put two of these up top. I did already pre-drill my holes. You'll need to have five holes spaced out evenly throughout the bottom. Then you have two on the top. The ones that are on top with these little um, hooks are for the line. You can hold your line on there. And then you need to use the screws with the little eyelets for the other part. Um, I think five to six work nice. You want several of them so that they can let the natural bend work in the fishing pole. Of course, this will take more than two minutes if you have a group of people. Um, or if your holes aren't already pre-drilled. We did this with about 25 participants last summer. Um, they all managed it very well. Um, it took a little bit of time to get all those kids through, but they also had some pretty cool fishing poles. One issue you might have is transportation. Some people just don't have the vehicle to haul off an 8-foot piece of PVC or an 8-foot fishing pole. Okay, so actually it's finished now. All you have to do is put the line on it. This entire craft probably costs about $1.25. Of course, I, did, I left off a couple of the eyelets just to save time so this post wouldn't be all that long. Tie it to the bottom eyelet. You have your line out here. Um, I like to use about twice as the length extra with the pole. So actually, you've got about three lengths from here to there and back. You can hook it around your hook. Bring your line up here to the end. But up here you could also do twice as much and wrap it back around the other end. And then to seal it, you can of course put your hook on it, weight, whatever you're gonna fish with. Got my bobber on here. And you have a finished fishing pole. And this thing actually does cast. You can hold it lengthwise. It might be hard to see in the video cast like this, if you have the couple lengths, you can probably cast it out about 15 feet. And that's a PVC fishing pole.